Hi everyone, this is Lori Walton, Empowerment Coach. I know it looks like a do-it-yourself construction YouTube, but this is a coaching YouTube. So I want to talk to you today about having an outrageous goal or having a goal and taking action on it and moving forward on it. So behind me, I've been working on a tile surround for my wood stove. This is a project I wanted to work on for years and it just hasn't gotten done. And this is the year and this is the time that I'm completing it. And as I've been struggling and working away at this, I realized this is just what I do when I'm coaching people on reaching an outrageous goal and that you need to have an action plan, you need support, and you need to do the inner work because a big goal will trigger you in all kinds of ways. So first off, you know it was procrastination because I've been wanting to do this for years. And so I've kind of overcome my procrastination and then my other resistances that have shown up and my perfectionism. Because when you do a big goal, you really have to break out of the way that you have been always doing things and doing things in a new and a different way. And that is challenging. And that's when a coach can be really beneficial and helpful. So I have been coaching myself. I realized, oh, I'm using the same tools that I would use with someone to reach their outrageous goals. So I have found support. I ask for advice from people. And then I do my inner work. I look at what's holding me back. I made a mistake and instead of beating myself, my perfectionist self beating me up, I'm just like, well, it's too late now and it'll really work out okay. And I'll probably be the only person that will really notice that I made this mistake. So. So that was a big deal to kind of do that and to keep working away at it. And another interesting thing I wanted to share with you about this project is that um, as I was working away on it, it was really a struggle to get started. The inertia to just getting my mind to think in a different way, to break down the tasks to the smallest thing that I needed to do. And I just struggled in deciding how I wanted to lay out the tile, deciding how I needed to lay out the back supports and working within the parameters of my, my site and within myself and, and working at that. And I just struggled for, this is like my fourth day on this project. And I just struggled so much in learning how to use the wet saw and figuring things out, doing the math, not my strong suit and getting it figured out. And each day was a struggle and just mentally exhausting. And the fourth day I came down here into my basement to work on this. And it was like my mind had rewired into tile mode. And I could think about things more easily, more clearly. It was like I had tile brain and I could think Things were easier for me to do. Problems were easier for me to solve. And this is really what happens when you're doing a big, you're reaching a big goal, you're working on a big goal. It's a struggle. It's hard at first. The things you're doing are new. You're having to create new neural pathways and you do them and you work on it. You just feel like you're never going to get ahead. And then things start to shift and you start to see things differently. You start to have other ideas of how you can do things. So um, this process, this physical process of tile installation has really been a great metaphor for how you can, how coaching can help and how you can use these tools to, um, to reach goals and other aspects of your life. So um, if you have goals that you're wanting support with, needing help with, reach out to me. 
My email is below and my Calendly schedule is below and um, we could have a little chat and see what would work for you. Uh, and I wish you well on your goals and your outrageous goals you're reaching towards and send me some positive vibes that I get my job finished before winter comes, which in Fairbanks, Alaska is not that far away. All right, Lori Walton, Empowerment Coach. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.